It is Wednesday, October 2nd. Uh, I'm a bit late with the video. It's 2.30 p.m. and that's because, boy, what a crazy day. Yesterday I went to the dentist. I don't know if I showed my teeth yesterday and you saw, look at them now. See that massive gap? That whole gap, and in fact, the whole back of my bottom row of teeth was completely filled with tartar, which is plaque that has hardened into, here they call it Zahnstein or, or tooth stone. And that's what it was. And in fact, the dentist said it was growing, it had grown 10 millimeters down into my gums. So, um, yeah, he had to remove it. I had to get injections. So I got home my entire uh, lower lip and lower jaw and tongue were numb, uh, which was an interesting experience. And I had power tools in my mouth, which was an interesting experience. Good news, I have no cavities and my teeth are extremely healthy. And I went in again this morning, which is why I didn't make a video. We had to get up early and go in early so I could make it to the dentist and then to my German class, which started at 8 a.m. So the dentist appointment was at 7.30 and we had to get up at uh, six to get there on time. So. Uh, today he checked it and my gums have already regrown two millimeters. So yeah, that's pretty awesome. And there's no sign of in infection. And so this was caused by the motorcycle accident. My tongue, uh, my spine pushed forward so far that it pushed my tongue forward. And I didn't realize I had this injury for 10 years. And over 10 years, my tongue slowly pushed these teeth apart and it's pushed these teeth out. And now I can't close my mouth because my incisors hit because the top and bottom incisors are perfectly aligned. So the dentist said I have about three teeth that actually make contact. So we're going to get all that fixed, which means that, you know, my nutrition will be better because when you chew your food more completely, you can digest it more and get more of the nutrients. That's why I love my Blendtec blender and my green smoothies because it's all chewed for me. I don't have to chew for half an hour. Anyway, you can hear I'm a bit excited. Uh, the German class was fantastic. And I have to say, it's a really inspirational group of people. There's refugees, you know, there's people from Venezuela, from Syria, from Afghanistan, from China, from uh, you name it, uh, Kazakhstan, one person, Albania, Georgia, the country, all over. Uh, I'm the only native English speaker in the class. And it just, it amazes me because, you know, I'm there to learn this for fun, but these people, literally their lives depend on it. They they're in a new country and they have to learn this to survive. I will survive no matter what because my work, filmmaking, is international. So I don't need to learn the language and fit in here to make a living. But these people, you know, their lives depend on it. And they maybe didn't come here by choice. They might have been forced here by violence or conflict or political turmoil, whatever. They're here and now they're committed to this. And it just really humbles me. And it makes me want to work harder in my learning German, but also in my life and in my work. So uh, maybe that's my message for today is, you know, don't be afraid to be inspired by the people around you. I, I feel like our culture today is so competitive that we are more likely to feel threatened by someone than inspired by them. And I would encourage you to be inspired. That's, that's how I've been able to achieve what I've achieved. When I meet someone who's done the things I want to do, I don't feel threatened or feel bad about myself. I look up to them and I'm, I'm curious, I'm impressed, and I'm inspired by them. So, and that mindset is why I've been able to sit down and have a conversation with George Lucas over lunch or invite Josh Lucas, I have a thing with Lucas's, into our house for coffee, although that was you, Dave Ammerman, uh, you did that. <laughs> but when you have this mentality, then yeah, the whole world is basically one big playground instead of one big I don't know, court where you're judging everything. So yeah, I'm so inspired by the people in my class. Um, and ich lerne Deutsch. No wait, ich lerne Deutsch. Hmm? I need to brush up on my German. Hey, come on, it's day three and I missed day two. So I'm behind, that's all I'm saying. But I got my workbook, I'm on it. See you tomorrow.